I'm a holistic doctor, and I'm a medical doctor. And we're here today to talk to you about the differences between us. Nice scrubs. I'm Dr. Michael Berglund, and welcome to Common Sense Medicine. Today, we're going to be discussing different kinds of healthcare systems. Some of you are familiar with one and not the other. Most of you are familiar with one called the medical system. The medical system is, includes hospitals, physical therapists, nurses, respiratory specialists, a variety of different number of uh, practitioners that insurance covers. Probably 75-80% of the people uh, exist in this world. The medical model uh, believes in um, preventing death. It's one of its big motivators. It tries to prevent communicable diseases. It also believes that um, symptoms are, if we can fix a symptom, we've somehow fixed the problem sometimes. The medical system doesn't have a lot of faith in the, the body being a smart uh, ability to heal uh, thing. It believes a lot of times that the healing comes from the outside. One of its primary things is figure out what the disease is. We have to name this condition because the condition will then tell us how we're going to treat it because there's a formula to how to treat it. The medical system also believes that there's a that substitution uh, in the case of for instance uh, hormones like thyroid or estrogen is if we can just bring them from the outside into the body that's just as good as if the body makes it itself. The medical system is sometimes easier uh, and I say this because the patient isn't really asked to make any lifestyle changes in most cases. If they can take a pill and not have to change anything, not have to exercise more, not have to lose weight. It's a, it's a lot easier and patient compliance tends to be um, uh, better in the medical model. In the holistic model, or some of you would refer to it as the alternative health care, uh, this system believes in restoration over substitution. We believe in, in finding the source of the problem uh, and fixing it. Naming the disease isn't as important as figuring out the dysfunction. In this uh, area of alternative health and holistic health, we believe in surgery as a last resort. Also in the holistic realm, we believe that the body is actually quite smart and it just needs us to help it. It just needs us to remove that thing in there that's blocking its path. Our job is to figure out a way to help. This alternative uh, health care system it deals with the people that are um, very conservative. That would be chiropractors, that would be acupuncturists, nutritionists. Sometimes you'll find uh, people that have uh, not naturopaths, doc they call them doctors of naturopathy. Uh, there's also chiropractic internists. I happen to be one of those. I've been in practice for uh, 21 years now and um, in this natural health realm. One of the challenges in our alternative uh, health care uh, is that we ask the patient as a, as a partner. We expect the patient to actually um, take steps to improve their own health. I believe that patients have gotten themselves into this mess and my job is to help them get out of this mess. There is no right or wrong answer here. Um, medical, alternative, uh, I'm just trying to show you what the differences are between two. Certainly if you break your leg in 15 spots or you have a gunshot wound, you need to be in the hands of a medical doctor. Certainly if you don't want to do any kind of modifications, you don't want to change anything, you probably belong over here in the, in the medical model. The alternative model is there for people that go, you know what, I want to be in control. I want to be the one. I believe I got myself into this. I want to help pull myself out of this. I want to uh, be an active participant in, in restoring health. If it means losing weight, just show me how to do it. I will, I, will do the, I will do the work. If it means stop eating this food, stop eating this food, I want to do those things. The alternative really lends itself to, to those types of people. I prefer the alternative health care, the holistic approach, because to me it's like, it's like a car. Um, when you have your, the, the oil light comes on the car, you have two solutions, right? Um, one solution is to either put duct tape over the oil indicator or snip the wire that sends the light to it. And you can say, well, I solved the problem. And to me, you didn't solve the problem. I want to know why. In the, in, the, in the car, you hook up that plug into the computer in the mechanic garage, right? And his machine will say what those codes mean that your car is spitting out. What I try and do for my patients is to help them and their bodies communicate to help translate what their body's telling them so that they can take better care. So they know when the oil light 
is coming out of their body, they go, I know what that means. That means this. That means I've done this, I've done this, I've done this. And they can make corrections, and then those symptoms go away. You look very nice too. Love the stethoscope.